Merci. The provocatively titled film How to Have Sex about three British teen girls who go on holiday with the aim of drinking, clubbing and hooking up won the top prize in the uncertain regard competition at the Cannes Film Festival on Friday. However, there was a slight hiccup. Molly Manning Walker was not in the room when the award for her debut feature was announced. The director was on her way back from Italy and running late from the airport. We now give the Uncertain Regard Prize and another warm welcome to the family of cinema to How to Have Sex by Molly Manning. <laughs> Molly has literally has just landed at the airport. She's about five minutes away in a taxi. I've Prompting jury president John C. Reilly to belt out a song to distract audiences during the wait. So Terry. Maybe you can sing. Yes, I'll sing a song. Is that all right? Yeah. And maybe through the miracle of song, Molly will appear. <laughs> this song has been recurring in my head all, all two weeks. Because the, tr the thing that binds us all together in film is that we pretend. Hmm? Pretend you're happy when you're blue. It isn't very hard to do. And you'll find happiness without an end whenever you pretend. He's coming, he's there, he's coming. Ladies and gentlemen, the director of How to Have Sex. Many, I just ran from Italy, guys, said the British director who was out of breath when she finally took the stage in a t-shirt and jogging shorts. I just ran from Italy, guys. That <laughs> um, this film has been like the most magical experience of my entire life. And um, every woman that's come into action with it has felt the same. That it like has allowed them to speak about something that we haven't been able to speak about for years. And so I really hope this changes the conversation. And also it's fun and like, as we've seen in Cannes, the best time of my life is in a party. So, uh, <laughs> Long live parties. <laughs> she made that speech up on the spot and ooh ah Melia said ooh ah Melia. Ooh ah Melia said ooh ah Melia. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. The Hollywood Reporter summarized the striking film as a quiet stunner while the Guardian newspaper gave it 4 out of 5 stars, calling it an interestingly unsentimental film without the coming of age glitches. We give our jury prize and a warm welcome to the family of cinema, to Lemut, La Rac Kamal. Hounds by Kamal Lezrak about a father and son in Casablanca who have to deal with a kidnapping gone wrong took the jury prize. So the best freedom prize goes to the incredible film Goodbye Julia. The first Sudanese film to be included in Cannes official selection Goodbye Julia took the Freedom Award. Director Mohammed Kordfani thanked the Sudanese people for their support as well as for not giving up. Last but not least, I want to thank the Sudanese people for supporting me, but most importantly, for supporting each other. Thanks to them for holding on to life and to hope and not giving up. In the worst time of my country, I'm extremely proud to be Sudanese. Yes. 
ensemble prize, and excuse my pronunciation, goes to Grara by Drao Salavisa and Hene Nada Mesoda. The Biruti flower, which follows the indigenous Kraho people in the heart of the Brazilian forest, won the ensemble prize for the directors. Who died in these massacres are here with us. And finally, we want to thank and uh, remember and honor all the spirits of the indigenous who had their lives interrupted by massacres all over our bloody continent. Thank you. Bonsoir. The New Voice Award goes to Augur by Balouchi. Balouchi. Augur de Balouchi, qui est un premier film. Ça aussi, elle est pour la RDC, elle est pour nos mamans et une spéciale pour ma bébé Elle. Et le prix de la mise en scène ira à parce que oui, elle est réalisatrice à Azmé El Moudir pour la mère de tous les mensonges. Azmé El Moudir, the mother of all lies, la mère de tous les mensonges. Je reviendrai pour remercier tout le monde, mais avant tout, je veux dire à ma, en arabe à ma grand-mère que je suis réalisatrice. Oui, Anna Moukhavija. Uncertain Regard is a competition focused on art house films that runs parallel to the main competition, The Palm Dior, which will be announced today.